South Argentinas, we all know they're going to come in through. But I think we've got a caller on the line now. What's your name and where are you calling from? Oh, hello. How are you all? My name is Robin and I'm phoning from London in England. How are you? How are you? Your name is Robin again? My name is Robin. R-O-B-I-N. Robin. Okay. Right. Thank, thank Robin you very much. Cooper. Thank you very much for calling to Spots on Love World. So what have you got to say? Um... Well, uh, about uh, rugby, um, have, I wonder what you uh, feel about the whole John Bickley affair. Okay. John Bi John, how John Bickley's playing at the moment. I okay. w wonder what your feelings were about it. Uh, well, the, the the whole affair with that, I, I think, I think, I think, I think he, he's actually been been very unfairly unfairly uh, under down a ban or, or whatever. Yeah. But I, I think it's been very unfair to him because he, he did what he was told to do. Uh, that's um, Williamson. Yeah. No, John Bickley, the one that, that he was at half time he did the oranges in the in the game. Do you remember the game? He had okay. all these oranges and, and wouldn't give them out to the other players. And then the referee came down and the referee was ill and they had to take the referee off, but he wouldn't give the oranges out. Do you remember it? Yeah, yeah, I think I've What do you feel about, about the whole affair, the John Bickley affair? Okay. What's your feelings about it? How are you? And what are the feelings that you both... It's a wonderful show, by the way. And what are your feelings about the whole... I suppose they call it Orange Gate with the oranges and John Bickley. Okay. Well, uh, you know, I'm not really a very, uh, very good rugby fan, but I think, I think, uh, you know, the player was treated very unfairly, and uh, yes. I think it's, it's because of the of the kind of media attraction that Me we have there, and I think it was unduly uh, Un brought yes. out into the lime out, lime lab because of of of, uh, of the media. Uh, it's not something that you know is not seen before yes. you know so I, I think the player has been has been treated a bit unfairly to be to be fair do you, do you think that they should still be allowed to eat oranges on the pitch well <laughs> <laughs> that's left to the union but i, I don't think that we're going to see the kind of ban that we a see ban, in, in, in football, in yeah. football now uh, because of that because i uh, you know rugby in this country Maybe yes it's, life it's ban. Still, uh, it's still, uh, you know, I, lo I love, I love, play I love seeing rugby, by the way. And uh, you know, I don't think we're going to see that kind of ban. But I, I don't think, I just personally think it's not fair on the player. It's not. Do you think really that maybe fair. that they should give them more seasonal fruit, apples and pears now, <laughs> and then tropical fruit? Um, you know, because vitamin C is very good for sportsmen, of course. Yeah, that's true. That's the uh, uh, Everyone should have vitamin C. I, I presume you you take vitamin C. I take sometimes tablets, which are very good for you, and I'm. Presume your viewers do as well. How are you all? Well, that, that, that's very true. That's very true. What have you got to say about the affair? Do you think uh, the, the... The affair, well, I think the whole... Uh, the John Bickley affair, I think they've made too much about it. And I, I think if he maybe had had a harder fruit, okay. um, it might have made, you know, a stronger, firmer fruit with firmer flesh. Maybe the whole thing would have just, you know, vanished. Okay. So, but what have you? But before you go off, um, off, off here, what have you got to say about uh, about the the the, 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 the Halloween one? Um, yeah, the blood um, blood gate issue. Is that yeah. the blood blood oranges? Uh, yes. yes. <laughs> the blood capsule. Oh, the blood. Was that where the uh, rugby player put a blood capsule in his mouth? Yes. Well, I think that if if everyone was to have a blood capsule in their mouth, then they wouldn't make such a fuss. <laughs> um, and also, if he sucked on a blood orange. Maybe the world would be a happier place. I think we should all learn from that and, and praise be to all. Anyway, thank you very much. Thank for you calling. very much. Thank for you very much. How are you? We really did enjoy that. Taking off to rugby, yeah. Uh, yeah, is really really impressive, and I think that player was really very undearly. Yeah. But although, well, we have to look at it in two ways. You know, he shouldn't have done that. I mean, the orange uh, affair and all that. But I mean, I think the player was uh, unfairly handled, to, yes, to, to, yes. to say the least. But I mean, going back to um, um, what's it called? To the world of uh, of of the World Cup. I think we've got another caller on the line. Uh, what's your name and where are you calling from, please? Yeah, here's Andrew. I'm calling.